Well, hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Gilligan's Island on a three hour tour. Okay, let's get going here. Last time we were over here. Let's get on our little boardwalk to heaven. And uh, we installed stairs down there. Oh, nice and clear. For this reason, because I can't jump. And then we have a set of stairs going up here, and we were working on the second floor of a boathouse. Oh, yeah. And I'm thinking what I'd like to do with this area here is have it all open. And we're going to get right into the whole building on this episode. We're not going to be pissing around at all. We are just going to go right into it and do what we got to do to make this the most epic base ever. I mean, it's already pretty badass over there. It's like a three-floor hotel. Now we're going to have a two-floor boathouse. Yeah, bitch is going to love me. This is going to be amazing. And you can see I went out again, crafted, crafted, got myself a whole whack load of wood, and I still have a little bit left inside my storage area, so that's cool. Um, if you guys have more ideas, one of this, one of my subs had a great idea, and we will be doing this. Um, it's to make a houseboat. We've got a speedboat, but we don't have like just a, a leisure boat. You know, this is when we want to go whipping between islands, and you know kind of kicking the crap out of everything oh 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 i gotta tell you guys something i found uh three more planks so i can't remember if we've already put a top on those if we have uh we're definitely going to be putting planks on there so yeah yeah we will do that before the end of the episode as well um but he had a great idea of making a um a houseboat and i was like yeah yeah oh hell yeah because, like, that's just a badass idea. So, like, a square platform. I think I have enough stuff. And I may have one piece of duct tape to be able to make the boat motor. Which, yes. Yes, 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 yes. So we will definitely be doing that probably in the next episode. I'm going to have to go out and get a lot more wood to be able to do that. Because um, I haven't found any barrels or anything. I have the one that I found before. And there's one out at the island, but uh, I can't seem to find any more. And that's why, you know, we might get to a point where it's like, yeah, you know what? Spawn in, you know, 10 barrels and we can do something epic. So if that's something you guys want to do, I can go get some mods or whatever I need to do to make that happen. Uh, but for right now, we're still doing pretty good. I'm able to go out and gather all the stuff that I need right now. Um, you can see the island behind, well, in front of me right there. There's still quite a few trees on it, so it's not like we have a shortage of wood. Like, I can go over there and hack away at those, but I'm trying to keep the ones close to me for later. And I attempt to go as far away as I can each time I go to grab wood. And um, that's why I wanted the mod on there where it gave me the extra inventory space. So I could stay on an island for a night and basically take down all the wood. And not have to, like, you know, get an inventory full of, you know, 12 pieces and then come back and then go all the way back again. Uh, it just makes it a lot easier for me to be able to stay there and get 100 pieces of wood on one island and then come back. Okay. We haven't fallen yet, which is great. We have our awesome blue front to this. Um, I almost would like to put, like, a diving board down to where the boat is, but... It seems like it would be pretty dangerous, and I probably would end up hurting myself. You guys know me. I broke my wrist or my leg or whatever the hell it was, like, the second day. And then uh, jumping off of that is how I broke it the last time. And that's why my health is always at 2. Because I have no morphine to be able to fix myself up. And um, I'm too scared to use the air tank to go searching in deeper water because it's not so much I'm afraid of losing air or getting sick or anything. I have the antibiotics to cure myself if I get sick. It's I'm afraid of sharks. And yeah, it's a valid fear. Not so much in real life. Maybe that's just because I don't live near them. So, I mean, there's no sharks in Canadian waters as far as I know, unless somebody happened to flush one down the drain and it kind of grew into like jaws size. But other than that, we got nothing here. Uh, there. Oh, we almost done. Look at this. This is so sexy. 
And speaking of sharks, I know I haven't really been around much with you guys on camera exploring, but uh, I have not seen a shark in a long time. Even out on my explorations, I hear the music, but um, I have yet to see them floating around the boat or anything. I'm not sure if that was a glitch. Oh shit, I don't want that. Uh, if it's a glitch with the update that they posted and they just don't come out like they uh, they used to or spawn as often. Um, I know that um, they were playing with the algorithm, I think it was, because they said that their pathfinding was off. Oops, excuse me. Mm hmm, what a sexy boat. I would like to make that even longer. You know, like put three more barrels there and there, and then extend it out like two more. <laughs> That'd be badass. Okay, that's for another episode. But like I said, first we're going to do the boat, uh, the boathouse. That is going to be a thing. Chills 504, you heard it here. He's going to build a houseboat. Boathouse, houseboat? Both. It's a, it's a thing. And that's actually what I was uh, saying to, the, to my sub. I'm sorry I forget his name and I'm just referring to him as the sub or my sub. But, um, and also I'm, I'm always leery of stating someone's name. Just in case they're like, dude, no, like, I don't want people knowing I watch you. <laughs> and um, also if they just don't want their name said on, on the air, I guess as it were. So, um... But if you do want that shout out, I don't mind giving it to you, it's not a problem. But anyways, as we were talking, it was like, you know what, I really wish they gave you the ability to put walls on boats. Because then you could make one of the most epic houseboats you've ever seen anywhere in the entire world. And I think that would be absolutely amazing to have. Look at this. Like, we're done here. Well, not done done, but now we're going to put the roof on. How much wood do I have left? Well, I have enough. Oh yeah, 76. That's enough for, what, uh, 13, 13, 14 pieces? Mm, we might have enough. That actually might cover the whole thing. That's going to be awesome if I plan that exactly right. I gave myself, I think it was 128 pieces to start. That might be exactly what we needed. And I wouldn't mind making a couple more beds. Uh, I've got some lashings that I can use to make that. And um, we'll put those up in the hotel. Because uh, we only have enough space right now for two guests. And we want to be able to accommodate, you know, maybe a dozen. Um, I'll obviously have to get more materials the more people that we expect. As you can tell, I've spent quite a bit of time out in the sun. I'm getting pretty delirious. And I am starting to see things, including people. So, yeah, that's the thing. I, that's also what I wanted to look into, or if anyone knows, if Wilson is still out there in the world, if uh, that is a thing. Because I know they had the uh, quote-unquote FedEx package that you could um, that you could find. It was like a secret. Uh, you could find a package. And the other thing was you could find Wilson as well, which was the volleyball with the hair sticking out. And uh, I wonder if it's still in the game. Because if it is, maybe we could make that an episode where we go on the hunt to try and find Wilson. And um, maybe if anyone knows, like, tips of where to find him. Where it's like, hey, I found him in a, pl a plane under the water. Or, you know, I found it in a ship or whatever. Maybe that's something we could also do. Because that'd be pretty cool if I had someone else to talk to. Because, well, it's lonely out here. You know, and I don't usually get that much shade. So by the end of the day, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty crazy. You know, I start talking to fish, and it's pretty wild. I start seeing all these weird colors and sparkles in my eyes, and I've lost count of what day we're on. I think I've actually, in all honesty, I think it's like day t day 42 that we're on, that we survived, 42 days. So we're at a month and a half almost. I wonder how you guys would fare. You know, myself, I I have a feeling, like, I, I went to Boy Scouts and all that kind of stuff. So, I have a feeling I would survive pretty well initially um, with the hopes... Birds! Birds! Oh, is he doing a dive? Oh, damn, that'd be so cool. I thought he was going to dive and go get fish. That's one of the new mobs. We didn't get to see that last episode. Woohoo! We got to see birds. Yay! And we got a roof. Yes! Now... Yeah. Right here. I just want to try something. I don't know. I think it'll work for the sides. 
Yeah. Oh shit, that's only one block. Yeah. That, oh yeah, hell yeah, that'll work. So, so we got a nice little like shady spot to be able to park our boat. Now, what I really wanted to try actually was out in this corner. Uh, we got four sticks left right there. Yes. Okay, so we can do another one over there as well. And that'll pro help provide the necessary shade that we need to be able to survive. The other thing was, oh yeah, I can still get in here. Okay. I was afraid that with this here, I'd be like, I can't walk past it. But we can, we can still do things. That's good to know. And now we can't fall out, which is good, because you know me. Alright. So we got this. Oh yeah. Let's go grab four more pieces of wood. We'll fix up that last little bit. Um... I gotta get the planks together so we can fix up the boat. Oh shoot! Um, gotta check the farms. Oh shoot! Okay. Do we have any fruit? I don't see any. Nope, not looking good. Oh, oh, there's a piece. Oop. Don't trample the garden. Okay, how are we doing on our things? Oh yeah, we definitely need to uh, get into some of the juices here. Oh yeah, so good, so good. Say so I'm a tightrope walker too. I don't know if you guys knew that, but I do things. You know, I I practice. You know, it's like I said, I got quite a bit of time. Uh, here, let's grab a bunch more wood. And you can tell now we're getting pretty low. We're at the uh, the red zone. This is where things get scary. I wonder how much I actually have. Uh, a hundred and five. All right. Well, it's it's. Well, you saw we used 128 pieces today just building a damn boathouse. Can you imagine putting the next floor on that? Oh my goodness. Uh, we need lashings and the planks. So let me, give me a few seconds, guys. I'll gather up the rest of the resources. I'll bring you back and we'll make the uh, beds for the hotel, and we'll fix up the boat. So I'll see you guys in a sec. All right, guys. Just before nightfall, I've got myself the little plank thing. I'm over here now. Yes. Now, will this connect? No, nah, we've already put the wood floor on there. So we can... Can we? Yes! Oh yeah, we got the boat. The boat is complete. Oh, I'm so happy. Okay, quickly, before it becomes nighttime, and then I'll sleep and make it daytime so that we can uh, place together the beds. And I got... Uh, I don't know how much wood I grabbed. What did I get? 31 pieces. I don't know. I can't remember how much a bed takes. Uh, but let's go. Oh, you're kidding me. It seems like this jump gets harder and harder. What the fudge? Oh, oh, oh. What's that barrel doing under there? Uh, oh my god. So much for getting there on time. Oh. Holy sh shit, that took forever. Okay, here we are. Quickly, turn on the light. Craft, there, floor, ah, damn it. There, there, craft, there, floor, wood, craft. Nice, oh yeah. Okay, let me sleep, I'll make it daytime. And uh, we will put together a couple beds. We'll set those up in the hotel. And we shall call this an episode. And then, guys, guys, oh, we get to make a houseboat. A houseboat. All right, guys, let me just uh, make it daytime, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, we're back. Yeah, it's bright and early in the morning, going through the tunnel of love. Let's close our door, just in case. You got to treat this like a regular house, man. Uh, I got to go this way over here. There's my bed up the stairs. And right into here. Now, we got our hammer in our hand. I think it's all the way down the bottom. Do our bed. Palm leaves? What the f- Oh. Boo urns. I don't have any palm leaves. Okay, I'll tell you what. We haven't actually finished off this side of the walls here. Let's do that. Let's finish off our walls. Uh, we would go with a... Wait a minute. What do we do over there? Nothing. What? We got two empty sets of walls here? Are you shitting me? Okay, well, we need half walls then. If we're going to be looking over at our um, thingy thing, our boathouse. Half wall. Craft. See, it looks like I have palm leaves because look at it. It's all over the freaking wall. 
tell you guys, I'm going nuts. I really wish I had some company. You guys gotta let me know. Oh shit. That's not what I wanted. You gots to go. That's four pieces of wood I'll never get back. Go away already. Holy crap. Okay, craft. Oh shit. Close. There. That. Craft. There. Wall. Half wall. That's better. Right there. Perfection. Perfection. There. Wall. Half wall craft there. And I think what I'll do right here is a window. Uh, wood window right there. Perfect. I'd like to see if we could do, uh, let's just see if we could do this here. There, wall, wood wall, craft. Nah, it's, oh shit. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Oh boy. Let's get rid of that. That's annoying. Okay. We can't plat put anything there. Wow. Up, up, up. There we go. Okay. Phew. And do this one here. Half wall. Craft. Right there. Come on. Craft. There we go. There. Wall. Half. Craft. There. Yes. Can you tell I'm rushing? No. Not at all. I like to try to keep these episodes under or around 20 minutes, so we are getting very close to that point. And a window, wood, craft, ba bam Wow, it's now safe up on the third floor. <laughs> yeah, you heard it here, boys. Third floor, holy shit. Are you kidding me? I think I'm dead. Uh, everything's frozen. I perished. Are you shitting me? I didn't know you could jump over a fucking half wall. Wow. Alright, so 49 days survived. I'm going back. I am not going to go out that way. That is bullshit. If it's a half wall, you should not be able to jump over it. Whatever. You guys let me know. I tell you, I tell you what. We'll leave it up to you guys. Do you want me to just go back? I'll redo the walls and that kind of shit. I saved it before I did the walls, so it's the only thing that we didn't do. I can go back to the save and uh, we can redo that there, uh, I think, because uh, my save game should be before that unless it automatically saved, then we're beyond screwed. Uh, but we got three options here, guys. We can start over brand new and do things like we were doing, straight vanilla, except for the, um, the mods that I use for uh, the enlarged uh, storage, or not storage, the enlarged um, inventory space so that we can gather more resources faster, which helps me out a lot. And then uh, we could do a full-on modded series so we can... I don't know if they have, like, uh, God Mode or whatever. The one that I use doesn't have it, but um, I'm sure there's one out there you could fly around and place things and build whatever the hell you want. We could do that. Or we just go back to where I was and we continue building the way I have been. So you guys let me know. Leave a comment down below or like or whatever you want if you want me to just keep going the way it is and we'll keep doing that. I hope you guys are enjoying this series. I'm loving it. Still having fun. 49 days, guys. We're almost at 50. This is badass. So I hope you guys enjoyed this, and if you did, make sure you hit that like button. And if you want to see some more episodes of different series every single day, make sure you hit that sub button too. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.